Hello everyone, welcome to the third and last part of my moving platform tutorial series. If you remember, in the first part I showed you how to implement horizontal moving platforms. In the second part I show you how to implement these vertical moving platforms. And now in this third and last part I'm going to show you how to implement circular moving platform. Well, here I have the object for my platform. As you remember, I use it for horizontal and vertical moving platforms. And now I'm going to modify it for circular moving platforms. Uh, this is again really really easy if you remember in for horizontal moving platforms i just need this line and for vertical uh, moving platforms i just need this other and guess what <laughs> for circular moving platform i need both so i let these two lines here and then I have to modify the play player object and here I'll do the same. Again, I, I'll explain it again. This line for horizontal moving platforms and this other for vertical moving platforms. And if I let both lines then I'll have a circular moving platform. Now let's see if this works. Let's wait a few seconds. And well, there you can see it. Circular moving platforms with only a few lines of code and they're really good thing about this approach is that you can easily modify a horizontal moving platform into a vertical moving platform and again you can modify any of these in a circular moving platform. Here you can see a version of the project with the three moving platforms circular, vertical and horizontal. You can download the project files in the link below. So, as you can see, here you have the three moving platforms, horizontal, circular and vertical. If you liked this video, please like, subscribe and share to support my channel. See you!